Hello, I'm Larry Fine, and this is Trailers from Hell. Today we're going to look at the trailer from Universal Pictures in 1977, The Car. The Exorcist had come out and was a huge hit movie. S Steven Spielberg had done his wonderful movie, Duel, which was about a giant truck. You never saw the driver. Um, I don't know if Stephen King had written Christine yet. In any case, demonic automobiles seem like a good idea. And this is a picture that's truly dumb. And I really enjoy it, but I enjoy it because I think it's bad. Guillermo del Toro, who's no slouch, thinks this is a good movie. He actually spent money and had a duplicate of the car made, which he drives around Southern California. Evil has visited the earth in many forms. Now it returns as the car. I don't have much to say about this incredibly dumb movie, except that some people quite like it. It's very well photographed by Gerald Hirschfeld in Panavision. There's some wonderful desert scapes as this completely boring kind of Lincoln Continental looking car creates havoc. You have these wonderful uh, POVs from inside the car that are tinted red, which leads us to believe there's something evil in there. See, Ronnie Cox, uh, uh-oh, wouldn't want to be that guy. This movie's really stupid. I enjoyed it tremendously in the theater. It's just, uh, I guess, what you'd call high concept. This car drives around the desert and kills people. Let's watch. They all know nothing can stop the car. James Brolin. We can't let him through no matter what. Stay in close. There's a wonderful thing coming up that Universal Studios did in all their monster movies where you'd have the giant praying mantis or tarantula or creature, whatever it is, it's right out that window. It's around here somewhere. I'm afraid I'm scared. No, I promise you I won't go out. Tell me what to do, baby. I, I, uh, There's that red POV. Something evil is in that car. The car. Dumb, but fun. 